Greetings world. We are anonymous. We are the people. Do you remember the movie called V for Vendetta? Well, allow us to let you into a little secret. This is Evie Hammond. In this movie, she represents you. She represents us. She represents the citizen. This is the scene where she is informed of the truth. As she struggles to come to terms with the truth, as she struggles to breathe, she sees something. This is the beginning of her awakening. And in the middle of all the pain, she finds something else, something more. She finds love. It was this moment that would come to signify the collision course of millions of people's destinies in a global solidarity march known as the Million Mask March. Anonymous would never be the same again. A new world became visible and excluded no one. So, what is the Million Mask March and why? Anonymous are fed up with the current voting system. The only participatory part of the system is our vote every five years. This is often ranked at the ballot box and bought out by big business interests. The real problem in modern day politics is that it excludes the people. Austerity is simply the weapon used to further extend the power of the 1% of people who hoard over 99% of the world's wealth. This is getting worse on a global scale, so we must do more to achieve global equality. It's broken promises that leads to citizens losing hope. This world needs hope more now than ever before. On November 5th, anonymous cells from around the world will release country-specific media statements to once again symbolize our presence as a peaceful movement of individuals who share an overall common goal of human freedom and protection from the victimization of government. Governments will never have power over its people again. The world is waking up. We are humanity's immune response. We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us. November 5th. November 5th. November 5th. Dear citizen, every so often we are faced with a choice. To fight for what is right, or to allow ourselves and those around us to be controlled by the greed of others.